All right, so I got to I got to crank pretty quick here, so I'm going to just get some of these uh, sh kind of shadow areas and things just laid in here really quick where they where they live up on this hillside. Especially up around that one tree.
All right, so that's it for me today. Thanks so much for hanging out with me at this uh, really cool spot, and I hope uh, hope you enjoyed this. There were some uh, some contrast things that I was really kind of looking for and paying attention to that I'm actually really happy with. I was able to achieve those without going over the edge and uh, having things get white and chalky. Um, I kept the color in there, and there's some areas where things got just a little bit muddy and I could scrape them out probably and repaint those now, but I'm just gonna wait until the paint settles down and then I'll probably tomorrow I'll go back in, as I always do, and correct just a couple of those areas, but I'll show you how I ended up here. Um, if I can get you a good look at that. Uh, yeah, I mean, I'm pretty happy with this uh, in general. I kept the, the strokes nice and loose like I've kind of been practicing and I really wanna do um, so trying not to get too tight that's always a good tip so anyway um, if you're new here I invite you to subscribe and uh, hit the little bell so you don't miss anything and you can follow along and uh, for those of you who've been hanging out with me for a long time thank you so much from the bottom of my heart I, I really do appreciate it and uh, you know I'm in short sleeves and I'm plein air painting and uh, if I was in Michigan, that would not be the case. So I am really loving it here in California, as you can imagine, and um, happy to bring you um, this, uh, this whole new adventure. So anyway, um, as always, I will catch you later.